what for you, how would you define what interleaving is? I always give an example. So imagine that you have a physics test coming up um, yeah. and it covers several concepts. So it includes Newton's first law, second law, and third law. Um, you're creating a set of practice problems to help you prepare for the test. How would you order those problems? One method would be to order them so that you practice all problems related to Newton's first law, then you practice all problems related to Newton's second law, then you practice the third law, and so on and so forth until you've practiced everything in these modular blocks. And this is what we call blocked practice. Yep. Another method would be to simply shuffle or mix up the order of the questions so that you're practicing one problem related to Newton's first law, then second law, then third law, and so on. Um, and that is what we call interleaved practice. Now, which of these two methods is likely going to result in better performance on the physics exam? Um, it's interleaved practice based on decades of research, basically saying shuffling up, simply mixing up the practice problems of different concepts results in better learning of those concepts.